Are you on Do you have a badge number? Are you on supervision? Do you have a badge number? I'm asking you a question. And I'm asking you a question. Okay, I'm going to go out and grab my supervisor. Um, okay, go ahead. Yeah, I, this is not... Uh, I'm just trying. I'm not even interested in you. Matter of fact, keeping you sir. off the camera, but I can put you on it. I have no sir. problem. So, sir. yeah. Um, so, you cannot be recording here. Why is that? There's an expectation of privacy based on our clients that come into the office. You're digging Hello. yourself a hole, bud. I already gave you the case. Stop, Look it up. Stop, 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 stop. No, 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 it's no, no, no. four stop. dice stop, versus, stop, stop. no, I don't have to stop, I can speak. <laughs> it's four dice versus Seattle right. that says people's feelings don't trump constitutional rights and you can be recorded in public space. So do you know this is a public space? It What's going on, Bay fam? It's your boy, Bay Area Transparency, and we're back at it once again. And for this video, we're in the city of Medford, Oregon. But no, it's not my arrest video from Medford. I'm not putting that out yet, but it will be coming soon. It's actually a video that I took at the adult probation office or community justice center is what they call it out there in the city of medford oregon keep in mind this was the very next day after my arrest in medford you guys thought they held me down and i tucked tail and left medford before i went back out to the other buildings uh negatory baby that's not how bat gets down Anyways, what we're going to see in this video is that the people out here, the probation officers, the police officers, they do not understand the law. They do not understand the way the First Amendment works. No surprise, I got arrested the day before this video, right? And you're going to see how badly they do not understand and will not accept the way that the law works. Will not accept the education, the opinion, probably didn't even go look it up, but I guarantee they will after this video is seen. As always, go follow us on Facebook, Bay Area Transparency Official. Go follow us on Instagram, at Bay Area Transparency. As well, Bay Fam, we have a new channel out. I know I put this in the last video, I'll put it in the next few. Go follow us at Bay Fam Clips. Bay Fam, all one word. Clips is the next word. I'll put a link in the description for you guys to go ahead and click. Go subscribe to that channel. We're uploading several videos as we speak. We're starting to get them all public out there. We've already got over 10,000 subs or getting close to 10,000 subs on that channel. So thank you, BayFam. I appreciate you guys. Just small clips, 1 to 10 minutes of old videos, new videos, whatever, all the videos. BAT and I'm out. All right, this is where we're at. Jackson County Community Justice. I believe that's the probation department. And then they have elections. I'm not concerned with the elections. I wouldn't go in there because I don't care who people are voting for. Um, but I am going to do the... Good afternoon. privacy right behind the window what section is this is this is this community relationships No, I'm good. Thank you. Just recording. What is it for? Say it again. What is it for? Uh, for something that I'm working on. Let's figure out what section is. Oh, yeah, this is definitely probation. where they take probationers through. Let's 
kind of funny that lady said was it what is it for like it mattered um Hi. How's it going? My How you doing? Jackie. I'm a PO. Cool. My um, name. Okay. Are you on supervision or? Well, say it again. Are you on supervision? Oh, I'm just recording. What are you recording for? Uh, just something I'm working on around here. Okay. Yeah. Could you tell me more about that? Mm, no, I can't. What's your name? The, mm, I don't give my name. Okay. Well, um, yeah, you can't be around to recording here, so. Um, Why is that? But I need to know why. Well, I got a story I'm working on, but why is it that I can't? Okay, do you work for anyone? Or is this a personal project? Uh, I'm independent. You're independent? Mm hmm Okay, do you have a business name? Or... Yeah, I do. What is that? Oh, I don't give that info. Okay. I don't want to compromise the story I'm doing, so. Okay. Are you on Do you have a badge number? Are you on supervision? Do you have a badge number? I'm asking you a question. And I'm asking you a question. Okay, I'm going to go out and grab my supervisor. Um, okay, go ahead. Yeah, I, this is not uh, for I'm just trying to get your badge number. That's weird. Okay. So, I'll be, I'll be right back. I to let her know that I was recording, but I didn't have to. What's up, mate? Yahoo, huh? <laughs> oh, boy. Oh, uh, Nelson? Yeah. No. Well, I can film anybody. So. Um, is David not in? Not available. Okay. Uh, does it say my check-in days? Some, some of these. Right, so this is a public right, building. You can definitely record in here. Huh? No, no mug shots. I try to keep private people off the camera. I don't really try to record private citizens unless they have an issue, you Are know. Are you auditing the Jackson County probation? Uh, I don't. I don't. Uh, re really, really want to engage, man. After you are talking shit for no reason, you know. You the fucking camera look like an idiot. Uh, I agree. You look like an idiot as well. So. Yeah, yeah fucking cl clown to me, as a matter of fact. I'm a fucking clown? That's what you look like. Yeah? Yeah. I bet you won't call me clown outside. I have no problem with it, bro. Mm -hmm. I ain't from Oregon, I'll tell you that much. Do you think you're tough you're Oregon? <laughs> nah, that's not what I'm Shit. saying. But I grew up in a lot tougher places than this. I bet. That's why you washed up past in Oregon. How you doing? <laughs> that's why I'm washed up in Oregon. <laughs> I, I don't even know why you're talking shit. I'm not even interested in you. Matter of fact, keeping you Sir. off the camera, but I can put you on it. I have no Sir. problem. So, Sir. yeah. Um, so, you cannot be recording here. Why is that? There's an expectation of privacy based on our clients that come into the office. Um, and That's so not true. Based on the information that you're telling me, well, there's some confidentiality here. Based on the information you've disclosed, um, I need to ask you to leave. You don't have a reason to be here. So, I'm, so I'm I, to I've disclosed to you I'm doing a news story. This is a public lobby right here, and there's no expectation of privacy in a public lobby because this whole building is actually public as far as the lobbies go. Right. Our clients have some so. expectation of confidentiality. You were recording through our window here. That's a secured area, so there is some confidentiality back there. Just, just before you guys make a mistake, let you know the way the laws work. The Supreme Court ruled that anything we can see from public, we can record. So I could walk up to the window and record as well, even though it's behind, as long as I can see it. As okay. well, there's no expectation of privacy. It's a public building. I'm always super respectful to everybody. Yeah, and I'm I trying to keep these people that. off camera. Um, but, uh, but I'm asking yeah. you to please leave. But I, you understand I have a right, First Amendment right, to do this and be here. So you really can't ask me to leave because I'm not disturbing anybody. I'm just <laughs> recording. So. Okay. Who's the clown? Can I speak to the chief or somebody who knows about this stuff? I, I, I'm a program manager here. Is there a, do you have a supervisor? Leave. Yeah, I'm a supervisor. So what business are you working for? So it's, I'm independent, right? Okay, it's so my own news 
business that I have okay. for news purposes. What's the news business name? I don't disclose that because it could compromise okay. the story I'm doing. Okay, sir. So, so you need to please leave, okay? So you guys okay. understand I have a First Amendment right to be here, right? You, you <laughs> Do you get that? You cannot be reporting our clients here and you need to please leave, okay? It's a public Thank lobby. You it's public. Leave. Yeah, not gonna. Thank you. It's a public lobby, ma'am. So, and I have another one to go to. So, these people are crazy. Yeah. People are crazy up here, man. They haven't been taught anything about recording in public. How's it going? So, whole public building. Right, public lobbies, you can definitely record. They asked me to leave for no reason. You got some dude who's on probation that's like on their side, which I don't understand. Um, as well, I need to get some information from them doing my story. And I've let them all know I was recording. So like, what's the issue? I just don't understand what the issue is here. So really there should be no issue let me ask him a quick question yeah. how do i get the information i need from here a public records request and a complaint form I'm not sure. Hold on. okay Okay, perfect, thank you. Want me to just wait here? Or? Uh, you can take a step over there. Okay, cool, thank you. Definitely the key, always be super respectful. We're not here to cause a problem, just exercise the right, make sure they're treating people on probation like they should be, you know, respectfully. I don't understand his, uh, his uh, thing. Just taking some pictures. I'm doing a story on the probation department. I was. Just, are you a supervisor here? No. Oh, I was just inside, but they said they didn't want me recording. But I, I mean, you can record in there. But yeah, but you can't be taking pictures of secure areas. Yeah, for sure. So the way the law works, just so you guys know, and I know this doesn't happen up here a lot, but anything you can see from public, you can actually take a picture. Okay, what's your name? Uh, I don't like to give my name, okay. but it is good to meet you, though. What was your name? And just keep in mind, I'm always super professional and respectful. Take care. All right, here we go. I definitely see Medford PD coming now. I definitely see Medford PD coming now. Let's see how they act and react. Yep, definitely stopping. They're definitely stopping. So we'll see what happens. Bay Area Transparency, baby. Bear with me, man. My heart is pounding right now. Pounding. How's it going? How you doing? Awesome, awesome. Beautiful day out. Hey, Name um, and badge number? Okay. Uh, employee or badge number? Either or. Whatever you guys give. No big deal. Badge deal. number is 60985. Okay. Employee number is 1055. And the name? Uh, Officer Boots. Officer Boots. Yes, is that, that's it? That's the real one? Yeah. <laughs> awesome, man. Right there. Just like you wear. Awesome, awesome. Hey. So what's up? Uh, the only issue, I guess, is with PMP. Uh, they just don't want you back on the property. Okay. It's public, though, right? Well, no. So once you go onto their property, it's private. So kind of like uh, if you went over to even the Medford Library. So technically that's private property. It's controlled by the library. So kind of like how PAP is just controlled by PMP, right? So is this a city county office? It is. Okay. But unless you're there conducting any lawful yeah. purpose. First Amendment lawful purpose. Yeah. yeah protected activity. Yeah. Yeah. So it's a new story. Yeah, news so, purposes. So you being here on the sidewalk, absolutely fine. Well, because they had a problem, uh -huh. and, and I, I was at, I asked for some papers. Uh -huh. So they came out and said leave. 
I asked for some papers, and then I said, you want me to wait, or what do you want me to do? They said, yeah, wait right here. Mm -hmm. And I, I said, well, they're calling a PD. I'll wait outside for them. So I just kind of hung out here for you so you didn't have to look for me. But uh, uh, j just an FYI, this is a public office. Mm -hmm. uh, any member of the public is allowed to go in there and conduct business. For instance, me asking for my papers. Okay. Or literally just to record a news story like I'm doing mm -hmm. is public business, and it's a public lobby. So, so, and that's the way that that the, works. The only issue with that is on private property, their house, their rules, right? It's not private because so, it's so, owned by the public. So, well, even the Medford Library, technically it's funded by the public, yes, but it's owned by a city of Medford. Right, but it's I mean? tax funded by the public. Yes. And yeah. a library might be different right. depending on if they had an ordinance But or just like so. the courthouse, right? They have rules that say like no camera. In a courtroom. Like Right. But in the courthouse, you can record. So the same thing with PMP. If they have rules that say no recording in their lobby and stuff like that. It's not the way it works. That's their rules. No, it doesn't matter. Policies don't trump right. the Constitution and don't trump so law. I, so I'm not, I'm not going to argue with you. Well, you don't need to. I'm, I'm just telling you the way it works. I'm being respectful, man. I, I mean, hey, dude, this I, is the way it works. Listen, yeah. Fordyce versus Seattle, Ninth mm -hmm. Circuit Court, right? That's this circuit. That's Oregon. Mm -hmm. I already said that you can record in public yeah. and, and people yeah. do not have an expectation and, of privacy in public. And that's why. And that's a public lobby because it's publicly accessible. So that's kind of the way that yeah. works. So unless there's right. a specific law preventing that specific office yeah. or some, an ordinance, municipal code. So it, if, this is proven and tested in the Supreme and District Courts. All right. So I'm not. not. Oh, I'm just telling you, I'm I don't, just, just my thing you know. is to actually look for officers to do the right thing and honor yeah. their oath to the constitution, which you took, right? Yeah. And right now you're actually telling me that I can't exercise my first amendment right in a public office. Unless you're going in there for any official business. Well, one, a new story is official business. Two, I did ask you for papers. Uh, you don't need credentials. So I'm independent. And the only people, let me tell you, the only people who give out credentials, there's no state or, or law enforcement agency that gives news credentials. It's mm -hmm. literally the person who owns that company. Mm -hmm. He prints them out and gives them to his yeah. people, you know. Yeah. So you really only need cr news credentials if you're trying to get, like, behind police tape and you're showing to let, have them let you or whatever. You don't even allow people with yeah, I'm, I'm just saying it's. Tape. I'm just saying it's those instances yeah. that allow that. Yeah. I know you guys haven't had this a lot up here, mm. but uh, trust me, you're gonna get it, and it's coming. And I'm here, and and we're doing it. So it's gonna happen. Right. Well, um, you guys already it. made a mistake yesterday. You guys will pay for that in, in court, and uh, I, no I just don't want you to make a mistake today. I have no idea what happened. Yesterday. I know, but I do because <laughs> I was there. <laughs> All right. Fair enough. So um, um, if I was you, I would tell them, hey. He can record in a public lobby. Right. He asked for papers. I, so, I need to go get my papers, and I'm going to record while I do that. Okay. You also understand that it's your guys' policy, and this stands for all law enforcement. Mm -hmm. It's actually 165.540, okay. right? That says or that arrested. law enforcement, yeah, that says law enforcement can be recorded while conducting yeah. their duties. Yeah. So that's that, why I have no issues with you recording. Well, that means them too. They're law enforcement. They're all peace but, officers. Okay, but that's that's more geared for if we're out in public, just like we are right now, right? Sir, you need to distinguish the difference between the sidewalk public and a public lobby. Now, I agree with you. Say I was to go behind that door, mm -hmm. that would not be public. Totally agree with yeah. that totally agree with that but in that publicly accessible lobby that any member of the public can go in and Ooh. conduct business that's public and the courts have ruled on it so i'm li i'm just trying to help you so you do the right thing because uh the backlash from this is For is sure. extreme right For it's sure. huge right. so uh i need to get well, my papers can i suggest I help you out? so yeah just go you out of trouble and keep them out of trouble do you want me to just go see if I can get your papers for you? Well, why don't we walk in, I'll record, they give me my papers, and I can bounce. I have no problem with that. All right, yeah. yeah, I mean, come on, man. It let me exercise my right. It's First Amendment, bud. <laughs> I mean, you're an officer. See, my thing is most police generally are pretty good dudes, you know, yeah. right? Like, I'm not anti-police or law enforcement at all, sure. but I am anti-bad police. Yeah. And it, when a cop does something like this and says, well, you have a right, I think you need to brush up on this, right. like, a lot. So just do yourself that favor. But what I'm telling you is 100% true. I, I know this right, and, and for a fact. <laughs> okay, I'm just letting you know. It's just kind of like, uh, so like if you went and tried to go record down at uh, Rogue Valley Mall, right? That's a private business. But Different. Publicly accessible. See, I was inside the PD recording this morning in yeah. your guys' lobby. It's this way, but.
Yeah. It's oh, this okay. side. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And and that that as well is a public lobby, yeah. right? Just like this is a public lobby. Mm -hmm. You guys can't stop that. You can't. Yeah. You can't. Oops, sorry, you don't want to bump no, into. No, you right. guys can't. Right. You guys literally can't stop that First Amendment right. Yeah. Here you go. I right, open well, the door for was you. Was anyone giving you a hard time about that? At the PD? Yeah. No, but here they seem to just because they don't understand the right. Gotcha. And so my whole thing is education, not confrontation. Gotcha. And so that's it, man. We just okay. we don't want confrontation. We just well, want the education part of it. Sure. All right. Well, let's see if we can. So get... if we can tell them, and I can get my papers, and yeah. then I will gladly be we'll on my way. No problem. Your, get your papers from the front here. Let me talk to this gentleman here. Cool. Well, recording, of course. Back with you, right? Recording, recording. Okay. Thank you. Let's see if we can get these papers now. Do they, they have them? Okay. Okay, thank you. All right, so, man, I can't be mad at this officer. Over, uh, well, so now I got her and the other girl's name, so I'm gonna file a complaint on them, and then I need a public records request so I can get all your guys' names okay, and salaries. you're gonna go through the county administration office for that, not this office. And do they have a hard copy? You'll have to go through them. But they'll have a hard because I don't do online. I'm not good with computers. Okay. They, 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 so they'll have a hard paper copy. Right and where can I get the address? It's uh, I don't know the address. Off the top it's of my head, courthouse. it's yeah, the old so courthouse on Oakdale. I'll get you the papers. So. Okay, cool. That works. Right. So I'm good with yeah. that. Yeah. So just so we're aware, it's a public office. All right. Because because we'll be back. I'll be back specifically, probably Monday. Yeah, I mean, I'm I'm gonna come back. Like, I know you guys think you're doing the right thing, but yeah, you're wrong. So, so okay, so talking with them, their only issues were some of the clients inside asking not to be recorded. Uh, no, one of the clients started saying how I'm an idiot and a clown, and do we want? Right. You, I mean, so he said he, he he's like better not record me, da, da, da. but you gotta understand, there's no expectation of privacy in public. Yeah, so it doesn't matter. But they're also a county office. It, which is a public lobby, bud. But if you start disrupting no workday? Somebody speaking with me is not disrupting. Me standing there recording is not disrupting. That's not the way the law works. Okay. So I'm being nice about this. Oh, honestly, do do do? honestly, I, my, my gut instinct tells me to go back in there and tell you to get screwed and I'm not leaving. But I'm not going to do that because I'd rather highlight you because you're doing so good so far, right? <laughs> like, honestly, I would. I, I mean, dare me and I'll go do it. You know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> it, 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 understand that I know this, like, yes. for sure, speaking to lawyers, researching the law, like. So, um, just, and that's all I wanted to talk to you about. Mm hmm is if they do go in there and uh, I'm not saying you were, I'm just saying I want you to be careful, right? So if you are going in there and people ask you to not record them, stuff like that, that's where I would be right. And, but you don't have to listen to that. You understand that, right? So, but then we're getting on the lines of disorderly conduct because if- That's not true. If, if they're, the people, the clientele are there being what they feel is harassment, okay? If they start feeling that, and then we have those reports coming in. You're digging then, yourself a hole, bud. I already gave you the case. Stop, Look it stop, up. Stop, 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 stop. No, no, Just listen. Not, no, it's no, no, no. four stop. dice stop, versus. Stop, stop, stop. No, I don't have to stop. I can speak. <laughs> it's four dice versus Seattle right. that says people's feelings don't trump constitutional rights, and you can be recorded in public space. So do you know this is a public space? It recording can never be harassment, sir. That I didn't, <laughs> I, did I say recording? No, I said interacting with people, and would they tell you to please stop recording them? And, and I don't have to stop recording. And if there's some sort of argument, stuff like that, that's not that, harassment. That's where it might get into. That. That's what, where I mean, good luck with that. But I can definitely speak back and say, hey, I can record in public. I don't know what to tell you. Sorry. And that's not harassment, sir. So you're oh. you're uh, you're stretching here. And I'd rather you just go educate yourself on this because like I said, this is gonna happen a lot and, and, and it's gonna continue. And as I get you guys all tuned in and educated to this, right. then we're gonna stay in and we're not gonna stop and, and you know, see how you guys respond to this, right? And that's the bottom line. Like, like the bottom line is it's public office. It's publicly accessible. If I need to go in and record, I can record. And you, you, you need to look the law up because I've already looked it up here in Oregon and it wow. says you can record in any public office. There's no law against recording in public. Do you want to take this down? You just, can you just say it and yeah. I'll so look it up. So it's the Jackson County offices. It's uh, 10 South Oakdale Avenue. So just literally down there on 10 Oakdale. South Oakdale? 10 okay. South Oakdale. Cool. Do you want their phone number? No, no, no. I'm just going to go in and record there too. Okay. 
All right. <laughs> That's the way it works, man. All right. We got to get you guys used to this. And honestly, officers shouldn't be mad about this. You guys should be supporting at, it. At right? any time have I gotten anything? Well, you're you're definitely telling me I can't do it. No, 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 no. I'm not. You're, you're misinterpreting, man. I'm not saying you can't record. What I'm saying is if you start, like, getting that altercation with people, then they start calling in. Now, like, the harassment side, which I don't want that to happen, right? But right. I, that, that's so I'm, I'm, I'm never confrontational. If somebody gets confrontational with me, I'm allowed to speak and, and, yeah. and definitely defend myself verbally, I right? Know, but, and physically but what do people, at the same time. But what do so. people do when, when they get angry? Hey, they call hey, us, right? Well, I mean, that's bullshit. That's not what you guys are here for. You guys yeah. are, listen, you guys are law enforcement, not feelings enforcement. I would so with honestly, the best thing for you to do in this scenario, you should have walked in there and said, he can absolutely record in here no matter how anybody feels about it. And, but he said he'll leave. And, and a man of my word, I did. And I'm going to leave. But I'm just a man of my word. If I wanted to, I'd stay. So we have to get you guys used to it. Somebody confronting you saying, I don't want to be recorded. Da, 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 da. That actually turns them harassing me right that's not me harassing them because i continue to record and so i don't know can you explain how it would get into harassment how it could well now we're playing what is right well that's what you've been playing the whole time I, all i wanted you to be aware is so we someone doesn't have an issue in the future, that's it. okay right? so if someone doesn't want to be recorded and they're kind of well it is kind of public open so the There's recording a, itself but if the that's the issue that's the nexus and the back and forth and people yelling at each other that's oh yeah i don't yell i'm all i'm always peaceful but if somebody calls me an idiot or something of that nature will happen in here i'll call them an idiot right back i have every right to and, do that and that's where i have every right to do that freedom of speech so I'm, it's I, these things man like 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 this is a losing battle for police officers i don't and i just still like I'm, i still try to wrap my head around it nowadays in 2022 mm -hmm. they're like why do they still have a problem like these probation officer girls in there were literally telling me that that their clients have an expectation of privacy in that public office which is not in any way shape or form true the supreme court's ruled on this so is the ninth district and so many others there's so many case laws that back this up like that's what i that's why your guys is privacy poli or police policy even says that people can record you guys mm -hmm. as long as they're in a private or public space they're allowed to be hey. so let me ask you a question and they're law enforcement they're peace officers they're law enforcement they count not just police officers is that a public space i'm allowed to be legally it's open to the public yes yeah so we're but good. just like o'reilly's auto parts it's open to the public but it's private but that's also controlled by a private entity. Right? No, it's not a private. That's a public entity right. building. Well, that, that's where we might have to agree to disagree. Well, dude, just look it up. Honestly, please. Like, I, I, you get see me here, I'm begging you to just educate <laughs> yourself on it. Like, I'd love you to know so the next time you see me, because it's going to happen again probably today, yeah. and 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 you'll be able to go, can, can you I already know what you're doing. <laughs> good luck with that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah good luck with that yeah so it's it's a remember they're a public entity they're mm -hmm. peace officers mm -hmm. and the the lobby there is mm -hmm. public behind the doors is private but we can also take and i told them this because they said well you're taking pictures past the door and i said the the law rule works that anything you can see in public you can take a picture of like i was out here even taking pictures up back here behind the gate and they tried to tell me i couldn't do that which sure. we can i mean sure. that's it man i'll um, but with that being said, so do you have any, oh, you're not a client of PMP, are you? Well, I don't answer those. Why, why are you asking? Okay. Well, so if you have any complaints or stuff like that, I take it up with the Jackson County offices. That's what I'm going to do. Okay, perfect. Yeah, yeah. I got to get uh, those ladies educated. Yeah. It's important. Cool. So uh, other than that, so unless you're there getting services or anything like that, they just don't want you back. Oh, I'll be back. Okay. Am I being trespassed? Yes. Okay, read me the Trespass Act then. The Trespass Act? Yeah, re read it to me. You yeah, read it to me. You have to, I want an official trespass notification. You want an official Oh, yeah, because it's a, yeah, it's a lawsuit, bud. Yeah, I need an official trespass notification, please. Absolutely. Right, Absolutely. Right. Well, you want to walk over this way? <laughs> yeah, for sure. Right. Okay, so I am now being trespassed from the public lobby in the probation department. So... That's this is cute. <laughs> well, so, uh, unless you have, so say 
you were arrested and you have a parole officer, right? And you want there and you want to get your paperwork. That you're there for services, right? So if you come back and you're creating disturbance in, in their eyes, that's why we're going to get called back, right? Right, you, and you can get called back, but mm -hmm. a disturbance in their eyes, feelings don't trump rights. And right now you're actually trespassing me from a public place without any so, law being broken, which so, is not how it works. All right. Well, that's right why I said, let me get the trespass the notice. Table. All right, we're going to get an official trespass notice from Officer Boots. They say I'm being trespassed from the public office in the probation department. Let's get some pictures here for a good thumbnail. Um, this is absolutely ridiculous. I can't believe that they're actually going to do this. And, uh, and, uh, yeah, the backlash is going to be crazy from this one. They're going to learn a valuable, valuable lesson. An extremely valuable lesson. So this is Officer Boots. We got vehicle 20. Already got his badge number. We'll get the uh, license plate number here. We got uh, E28. Two eight nine seven two nine. Two eight nine seven two nine. He is in Edward, and he's going to give me an official trespass notification. So I'm officially trespassed for recording in a public place. <laughs> give me one sec. I just get that info for you. Uh huh. Oh boy, I don't think these people know or understand where they where they're going wrong here. So the bottom line is, if I need to go in there and record my interactions with these police officers, do a news story, get public information, public documentation, and I want to record my interaction, I have an absolute First Amendment right to do that. But yet, I am now being trespassed because I utilize that right. And so we say it all the time, rights are like muscles. If you don't, uh, you know, use them, you lose them, right? So you got to flex your muscles, you got to flex your rights. And so when he told me I'm trespass, I want official documentation to give to my lawyer to show that these people have now trespassed me, right? That way we can file complaints and, uh, you know, do whatever else we need to do, file lawsuits or whatever. Um, as well as when I come back, because I'm going to come back when they arrest me i can already show that they that they're just being dis discriminating against me for using my first amendment right so it's unfortunate that the oregon uh police up here the city cops here in medford don't know this and uh but that's what we're here to do we're here to train them like i said education not confrontation so so all my paperwork has to deal with if you're actually being charged with trespass i don't have anything so uh, no, I'm sorry, I didn't catch you that. I won't get it. Okay, so, sir, is that okay? Yeah, yeah. Okay. All right, so what I can give you is uh, my card, and everything that I do is obviously documented and recorded. It's just an incident number, so it's J443, and then just note today's date, 812. Uh, okay. If you'd like a copy of that. All it is is pretty much a printout of... Kind of like my computer log mm -hmm. so it shows where i checked out who i talked with if anyone was ran anything like that. um and then any comments that i put on there okay so um my suggestion to you um would because i i do agree it is kind of that gray area right it's not gray so if you go in and for whatever reason disrupt their normal business Okay, and you're not there for a legal reason. First Amendment's very legal, okay. right? That's, that's where I'm saying that they're going to call us back. Okay. I, no, no, I get it, but you are officially. Tra I want to be clear. Unless for lawsuit, the way the lawsuits I, work, I have to be very, very clear. You yeah. know, I'm doing this for news purposes. Yeah. Okay, unless, I'm a journalist, and unless, I want to be clear. Are you are officially trespassing me from this premises, right? I want unless, it to be very clear. Unless it's for official business. And the First Amendment is official business. Any business that you're doing to conduct with their services. Right, right I'm doing a story on the probation office. Yeah. And I'm allowed to record probation officers yeah, but per it, the Constitution. But it's also their building, and if you're not there 
getting services just like if someone from Fox came down and they weren't doing it, they could ask them to leave as well. It's not, it's just not true. Okay. It's not true. It's a public lobby. If we're doing a story, I don't need permission to do a story. You know, it, it just, you don't need permission to do the story. You don't need permission to be in the public office. So Maybe. I want to be very clear. You're, you're dancing around it. I want, am I officially trespassed from this unless lobby or not? Unless you're there conducting official business. And so the first amendment is official business. So I'm not trespassing. That's where I'm, you can't, I'm you, you either have to, the way the trespassing law works in Oregon is you either have to trespass me or not trespass me. Unless you're, so it's kind of like the hospital. Right? It doesn't work like that. I can't trespass someone from a hospital because everyone has right to care right? right but as soon as that care is over and you're discharged there have been times where a hospital calls us and like hey this person is now trespassing but again most hosp hospitals are private oh. this is public right and that's and that's, this is totally different because i'm allowed to record peace officers during the line of duty right when they're conducting their their job in public which is a public lobby i mean well why are we dancing around here you either need to trespass me or not like you can't the thing yeah. is, is if you guys come and arrest me for trespassing because I go back in and record, I was never trespassed because you're not being clear about it. So you have to clearly trespass me and you're, I'm documenting it. You're trespassed unless you're there conducting <laughs> You're not being clear about it. All right. Well, I've explained it to you. Do you have any other questions for me? Uh, yeah. Can I get a card? I'll give you one. But this doesn't have your info on it. No. This yeah, is, it has all your contact info? Yeah, Officer Boots. Oh, what about, is there one for your supervisor? Like an email or phone number or something? Uh, I can get one. Because just based on the way this works now, I'll have to f basically file a complaint on you now because of the, the way okay. you handled it and all that stuff. So that's why I'm trying to right. get that info so um, I can send it up. So I'm actually on overtime right now. So the supervisor working isn't my direct supervisor. Gotcha. Uh, that's Sergeant Dorn. But it's the same way I can just send it into the PD, correct? Sure. Oh, yeah. yeah. Okay. They know where... If, uh, any supervisor that you can talk to, they're going to know who who I am and who I work for. Okay. So that's cool. That's not a that's not a problem there. So okay. yeah, if you just go down the lobby and just say I need to talk to a supervisor, they okay. all know who I work for. Yeah. Okay. So. so I'm letting you know I'm unclear of whether I'm trespassed or not because <laughs> unless you're there conducting official business. Yeah. The law says that me recording is official. If I need papers, that's official. If I need papers and I record while I get papers, that's official. So you're just really not being clear as to what. No, official well, I business think I, am. I think you just don't want to interpret it that way i'm just trying to know how right. to interpret it so if i need papers right. and there, i walk in and record am i is that official is, business is there to you anything or? else i can help you with well i'm trying to understand the interpretation and i've explained it to you no you're just saying official business what is official business sir so if can you, you were, explain that if you were a client there and you had to talk to uh, i'm not a, i'm not a client what if i just want some papers or to ask if i can get an interview or something of that nature I would say there. Looks like their shit's stuck. Uh, do you mind if I oh, address that? Oh, it pounded. Yeah, it was stuck. Uh, let me make sure they're okay. If you do have any questions, please feel free to come talk to us. Okay? All right, take care. So, so I'm officially trespassed, but yet he says for official business, I can. I can go in there. So the question is, that's vague and ambiguous by nature. Am I trespassed or am I not trespassed? Because if you're trespassed, it means you can't go back. So the bottom line is, if I have, if I need papers or things like that, or just want to record my story, he's now just trespassed me from public property. Just like he says, he can't trespass somebody from a hospital. You can't also, Officer Boots cannot trespass somebody from a public lobby. And I don't know, I don't think that guy's truck got stuck. I think that guy's truck just... Do they appear to be okay? Seemed okay to me. Okay. Yeah. I, like I said, I think it got stuck. Okay, cool. Uh, I'm, I'm sorry, was, was there anything else we needed? Yeah, I, I, I'm just making the record that I'm unclear of whether I'm trespassed, so. Fair enough. Cool. Right. Good luck to you, bro. Take care. See you next time. See you later. See you soon. <laughs> nope, <laughs> 10 minutes. All right, so now I'm going down to the county.